Once upon a time in a city, there lived a young man who was incredibly shy. He was so timid that he couldn't bring himself to speak to anyone, even those he knew well. This shyness had become a heavy burden, preventing him from leading a fulfilling life. As time passed, his shyness only seemed to grow, making him increasingly sad and isolated. His family members were deeply concerned about his predicament, wondering if he would ever break free from this shell and achieve something in life. Every time he tried to speak up, people took advantage of his vulnerability, making fun of him. This took a toll on him and his mother, who watched him suffer in silence. When he was a child, people found his shyness endearing and appreciated his innocence. However, as he grew older, his shyness became a hindrance, causing him immense problems. He desperately wanted to overcome it and communicate openly with others. One day, after a particularly embarrassing encounter with his father, the young man reached a breaking point. Filled with frustration, he contemplated ending his life. As he stood on a mountain's edge contemplating the abyss, a gentle voice interrupted his thoughts. Son, it's easy to give up on life, but you can't get it back once it's gone, said the voice. Startled, he turned to see a Buddhist monk standing there. He was taken aback and remained silent due to his shyness. The monk continued, Why do you want to end your life? Every life is precious and your problems can be solved. The young man, hesitant at first, finally opened up about his overwhelming shyness and the difficulties it had caused. The monk listened patiently and then said, Shyness and fear are different. To conquer your fear, you must first identify what you fear the most. The young man confessed that he was most afraid of speaking to his father, fearing his disapproval and anger. The monk probed deeper, asking about the thoughts that plagued him during these encounters. The young man revealed that he often worried his father didn't love him or that he would say something wrong. The monk explained, Fear and shyness stem from the unknown. When you fear something, you cannot communicate openly. To overcome your fear, you must address the root of it. The young man desperately asked for a solution. The monk advised him to tell his father about his feelings and ask for money, but he had to return the money afterward. Initially terrified, the young man followed through and was surprised when his father responded with understanding and support. Encouraged by this newfound confidence, the young man returned to the monk and asked for the solution to his shyness. The monk, however, challenged him with one more task. He handed the young man a simple idol and told him to sell it in the market, obtaining 100 Sony coins in exchange. Only then would he reveal the solution to his shyness. At the market, the young man struggled to sell the idol until he began boasting about its miraculous problem-solving abilities. People flocked to buy the idol, and he soon realized that confidence was key. As the crowd grew, he sold the idol for a substantial sum. Rushing back to the monk with the money, he believed he had overcome his shyness. But the monk explained that it was not he who had solved the problem. It was his newfound self-confidence. The young man realized that he held the power to conquer his fear. As he gradually eliminated fear from his life, shyness faded away. He learned that self-belief was the key to facing challenges and achieving his goals. In the end, he understood that the true solution to his shyness came from within. With newfound confidence and determination, he embarked on a journey to embrace life and communicate openly, leaving his shyness behind. And so, the young man's story became a testament to the power of self-discovery and the ability to overcome one's fears and limitations.